Good morning, LG, and today is Friday the 13th, 2023. Please stand for the Pledge of Allegiance. Place your right hand over your heart and face the flag. One, two, three. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the Republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Please remain standing for the LGN pledge. One, two, three. I respect myself and others too. I am responsible in all I do. I stay safe each and every day because that is the LGN way. We are respectful, we are responsible, we are safe. Little school, big heart. Friends, it's Friday the 13th. I didn't realize that until I was driving into work. I heard it on the radio. Uh, some people think Friday the 13th is bad luck or like they have a superstition about it. They think bad things are going to happen. I don't believe that. I just don't. I don't. Some people really like the number 13. They actually choose it as their uniform number in sports. Uh, they're not afraid of black cats crossing their path. They'll walk right under a ladder. Uh, they'll break a mirror and not worry about bad luck. It's interesting. It's interesting stuff. So, but to have a Friday the 13th on a on the month of Halloween is, is pretty cool. Um, I just want to let you know, my friend Lily, whose birthday was yesterday, chose a dolphin birthday book, and she was so excited. And then she said to me, do I get to keep this? I said, of course. So that's the cool thing about birthday books, my friends. You get to keep them forever. You want to give them away to a friend later on or donate them to a library when you're done with them, when you grow up, fine. You want to keep it forever, that's, that's up to you too. So we give those birthday books thanks to the PTC um, for free and you get to keep them forever. Really cool stuff. Hey, listen, we've got uh, Trunk or Treat coming up on the 27th of October. It's a Friday. And right now we're having a candy contest to... to um, Get a bunch of candy to hand out that night. So, right now, the tally is as follows. We've got kindergarten with seven bags. We've got second grade with 11 bags. Third grade with 12 bags. And coming in in first place in this contest right now, we've got first grade with 18 bags of candy. So, nice job, first grade. Keep donating those bags of candy. We'll see which grade is going to win. I also, thanks to Mrs. Puntini, have our Purple Heart Choice Board winners ready to announce this Friday morning. First up, we have Joseph De Silva. Nice job, Joseph. We have Isabella Goff. Nice job, Isabella. We've got Lily Roberts. Nice job, Lily. We've got Jacob A. Jacob Amancio, I'm thinking. Nice job, Jacob. And we have Braden McClelland. Nice job, Braden. So the five of you, at some point today, come visit me in the office, and we'll get you your your Purple Heart Choice Board prize. Sound cool? All right. I think that's all I have for today. I hope you have a wonderful Friday, a great weekend. Weather's supposed to be good. Awesome. I'll see you around school today. And don't forget, Mr. Jenkins loves you. Bye.